Guys, today we have something new. Today's special board. Uh, we're gonna try to bring this whenever something funny or something happens. Today's special though, James Harden. And what was he having? It looks like a little bit of everything. William. <laughs> James Harden was looking pleasantly plump last night. In <laughs> pleasantly mean, plump. I mean, shit, man. That dude looks like he hasn't ran in a minute, let alone play an entire NBA game. So there was a super funny clip where the announcer, he's, you know, poor guy. James Harden's doing his warm ups, whatever, doing layups, shoot around. And the announcer goes, James Harden definitely had a pre game meal. I, I really feel at this point, Dale, that James Harden wants out. And I don't know if he's pulling a Mac. From Always Sunny in Philadelphia, where he just comes back in one season and he's just like 400 pounds overweight. And I'm, I'm exaggerating; he's not that bad. No. But for, to be a professional athlete, and we've seen how slim, you know, James yeah. Harden has been. Oh yeah. And some of like the kind of like interesting, like I wouldn't say vegan diets, but some of like we'll just say interesting diets that he's been on. Yeah. He's been pretty fit. He's a tall yeah. guy. Holy shit, is he trying to eat his way out? I mean, this is just the problem that I have. You look at guys like LeBron who like have dietitians. You look at some of the other Traveling guys, dietitians. Yes, that who like with just him all the care. time. Yes. Like James Harden is in this category of talent. Yeah. Like I would He's expect... He's up to your score. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. James Harden is not in any way, shape, or form considered obese at this point. But just looking at where James Harden has been year over year, you can tell that he hasn't taken the best care of his body. He's probably not eating the healthiest right now. He and no matter shape. what... Yeah, he does. And last night he did say, and I will quote this i love this city i literally have done everything that i can i mean the situation is crazy it's something that i don't think can be fixed he pretty much cemented that he wants out of houston john wall also had a quote last night saying like if you don't buy in it's hard to win so those two don't seem to be getting along hopefully houston can figure this out because james harden's usually very fun to watch and right now i'm just not having fun watching him God, a couple years ago there are chris paul hamstring away from possibly dethroning the Warriors. Yeah. That's insane. I, I don't know where Harden goes. Do you pull something off? Maybe like Chicago pulling like Zach Levine, bring him over there. Do you bring him to Brooklyn? I don't know what you do, dude. I I'm have not no a team that even wants him around my culture right now. If I'm a head coach or an owner, that's I think something. he's literally trying to eat his way out of fucking Houston. Wow. He's eating all the Texas barbecue, which, you know, I've been to Dallas like once. It's okay. It's not <laughs> the most impressive food. I like your barbecue. I like Dale's barbecue. That's all that matters. I smoke but. that good meat. <laughs> James Harden, uh, I don't know, man. I am. Yeah. I'm pulling for you. I still like James Harden. So if this might be a creative strategy, a strategy to get out of Cleveland or um, out of uh, Houston. Yeah. And, and so as good. a sports fan, I am going to make the plea: James Harden, Kyrie Irving, please get your shit together. Miss watching you guys do unbelievable things every night. <laughs> uh, guys, thank you for watching today. Please give us a follow at WATM Daily, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Apple, Spotify, Tiki Taki. Give us some subs, shout us out, share us in your story. We appreciate all the love. See you guys on Friday. See you. Whoop, whoop. Corvette, Corvette.